All right, guys. Today I'm going to show you how to uh, download and set up a Streamlabs OBS stream when streaming on console, whether that's Xbox or PlayStation. Um, so let's hop right into it. This is going to be a very uh, starter edition for your stream. You can uh, customize it more as you get along, but I'm going to show you how to do that now. So let's hop right into it. The first thing you're going to want to do is go to Google and you're going to want to type in Streamlabs OBS. Alright, so it loads up. You go right here, the first one, Streamlabs OBS. Now it's going to bring this page to you. You're going to click Log In. And I'm already logged in, so I'm going to log out and show you what you'll see. You will see Log In, uh, Log In with Twitch. I stream on Twitch. If you stream on YouTube, go ahead and log into YouTube. But I stream on Twitch. You're going to click this big green download Streamlabs OBS button. Now this is the button to actually download the software on your computer. Uh, I can't miss it. So once you download it, uh, you open it up. So I have mine open up uh, right here. Uh, it'll ask you a series of questions. Uh, the first time you open up, uh, just fill it out however you want. It doesn't really matter for the way I'm showing you because you're going to create a whole new uh, scene anyway. But uh, so what the first thing you want to do once you're here is you're going to go over to themes. Now themes are just the overlays uh, that you can use uh, for your stream. So pick a stream overlay that matches your stream best. Uh, good colors and good overall feel to the uh, stream. So you ch say I choose this one. It loads up. This uh, page has been all laggy today. But uh, anyway, it loads up. Now what you're going to want to click is install overlay. Uh, now this is going to install the overlay to your editor right here. Uh, so you, ch you install the overlay and then you go back and you'll see live scene, be right back, intermission, uh, everything that you uh, was in your theme. You'll see it over here in your scenes. Uh, but once you have all that, what you're going to want to do is you're going to add video capture device. Now this is going to be your uh, game capture card. So I use an Elgato. Uh, it's pretty popular. Most people, whatever you use, you use video capture device. It's a capture card. So you're going to add and you're going to name it whatever. I'm going to name this Elgato capture card. Elgato capture card. Like so. You add the new one. Now you have two choices here if you have a webcam. I don't have a, a webcam hooked up to my uh, PC right now, but if you did, you would choose, you'd have two choices since they're both video capture device options. Uh, choose the Elgato Game Capture for now, and then it pops up like so. You add to source, and now I'm going to, now you see everything you see is my PlayStation. I'll show you that it works. I'll show you you can hear everything. I'm just going to move this around real quick. Boom, you can hear everything. Looks good. Uh, but that's the full screen. You can't see what I'm seeing, so I'm going to move this down. So here is your Elgato. This is the PlayStation. See, it works like you move it up uh, on top. You can't see my screen. You move it down, you can see my screen. Uh, but for the sake of this video, I'm going to show you right okay I've got a sound capture is here now let's say so these would be your uh, chat box your uh, everything that you downloaded in your scene through the theme so chat box alert box uh, webcam webcam frame all that fun stuff is going to be here in your sources but for the stream you're going to want to put it at the very bottom because uh, you want all this stuff on top you just can't see because boom 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 moves like that right it works like a blanket alright now so uh, if you want to add something say you want to add a sub goal to your stream now your stream is probably obviously looking a lot different a lot better with all the webcams and everything so you're gonna want to go to add add sub goal add new uh, all right, I already have one set, so I'm just going to use the same one. Uh, 
boom done add it all right now so if you put this below here you're not going to be able to see it because it's covered up by the display capture which would be your elgato like that but now if i move this back now if i were to just move this over so you can see this is a better example uh sub goal i move it in front of the elgato you'll be able to see it on the stream actually so that's how you want to set stuff up like a blanket that's how you add all these widgets to your stream that's how you add everything you obviously will want everything you want to be seen above your elgato capture card uh, source so webcams all the fun stuff all the chat boxes everything all the widgets you want that above your elgato in the sources section that's pretty much how you set it up guys um, I hope this video really helps um, obviously there's going to be a lot more fancy than this it'll be working you'll be able to stream you'll be able to talk you'll be able to do everything um, so thanks for watching this video guys uh, I stream on twitch at left side 850 and um, check it out it'll be more videos for your console stream support coming soon thank you